hello everyone come on in welcome back welcome if you're new be sure to put a like on the video subscribe and hit the bell so you know when i'm dropping another one i have some really great specials going on right now with readings workshops rituals y'all have been tapping in and i'm so super proud of you for showing up for getting in on all of this esoteric juiciness so if you would like to get a service from me if you'd like to get into the workshop we have going on make sure you click on the links in the description box below if you would like to donate to me and the platform i do light candles for you and say prayers and blessings over you all of that information is also linked in the description box okay y'all so the first thing i was getting with this message this is a channeled weekend message for you all i may pull some oracle cards we'll see what's up but um i was really getting some of you coming to um a reward or an opportunity or an invitation through sheer willpower like through sheer determination you are able to have um some sort of success okay and i think that's really freaking powerful i'm so proud of you some of you this has to do with um your spirituality I feel like some of you might have been practicing your spiritual gifts or um, like mediumship abilities or readings or um, Reiki, something that you're into. You've been practicing it or you're, you've been wanting to get, um, I guess, more tight in a certain area, right? Um, you've been wanting to get a certain spiritual practice fine-tuned. I feel like you're going to have a breakthrough this weekend or you already had a breakthrough and you're going to get deeper and deeper into that new journey for many of you. Some of you, this has to do with stability in your home. Um, you could have did a clearing ritual. You could have poured libations. That's been coming up with not only, you know, those I, I rock with in a day to day, but also in the collective. That's been um, some of the messaging coming in. So, you know, you've been protecting your home. You've been clearing out low vibrational energies and entities. You could have gotten a ritual from me because many of you, you have been tapping into the energy clearing rituals as well as the divine justice rituals. So shout outs to y'all for taking part in that. Okay. Um, others of you, this pertains to money. Maybe you were hesitating going after a particular um, investment. This could be stock. This could be Bitcoin. I literally was just talking to a sis about Bitcoin yesterday. Um, this could be any type of investment that you're wanting to come into. I feel like you weren't sure if you were going to succeed in a certain area, but the divine is saying like, yes, you will succeed. You will have breakthroughs. Many of you, you're going to be getting a new home like today or this week. Something like that is happening and you're shifting. Some of you, you've been manifesting this new place this new um manifesting this new career this new chapter of your life you've been envisioning it giving it color shape and sound and it's a real life thing that you're coming into so congratulations all right i am being called to pull a couple cards um and i was really getting somebody definitely doing your new moon um manifestation rituals You've been definitely doing your house clearing. Wow, seven of wands. Look at that line. I really love this energy for you all right now. It's really giving me that protection energy. Some of you have been calling in your guides, your protection to come in and to slay these foes. Some of you have been enduring um, spiritual warfare, psychological, psychic warfare. And you have been pinpointing the people that it's been coming from. Um, and also, like, where? How is it taking place in your life? Many of you, you've been set in traps for people. We talk about this all the time, right? On this platform, they feel like they've been setting traps for you. And really, you're the trap. So some of you, this is what's what has been taking place. You've been, you've been clocking this um this type of energy like this infiltrator type of energy that comes in and it sabotages 
your thoughts and how you feel about yourself. You've been pinpointing it. And I feel like that's also tied into the message of you're accomplishing something by sheer willpower, sheer um, spiritual just authority. Like, and I, I freaking love that. I love it. You're developing a relationship as well with your with your spiritual side. It's getting tighter and tighter and tighter. And they're really proud of you is what I'm getting. They like the relationship that you're creating with them. Okay. They like your ability to tap into the unseen realms. And I just got chills. Many of you have been doing it. Like I've been, um, like I've been saying, many of you have been tapping into your psychic mediumship abilities. And that's what's going on. You're connecting with the other side, the underworld, the celestial realms, you're doing it more and more. Someone out there, you're a real live psychic medium. And I don't know if you know that or not, or if you're really choosing to tap in, but your people definitely visit you. They definitely speak to you. I just heard some um, sitting by your bed. They sit by your bed and they talk to you. Look, wow, you have the page of wands. You have the page of wands. Wow, this is some amazing energy. So, oof. So, for whoever this message, message resonates with, you have some spirit guides and some ancestors that literally sit by your bed at night and they talk to you. They tell you what's going on. They tell you what your path is is calling for like what you're needing to do the st type of steps you're needing to take the connections um they're also notifying you of of these spiritual attacks they're showing you these people they're showing you um even the home right a home with with um with a staircase on the side of the house that leads out into like a street or kind of like an alleyway and then there's like a street type of thing but I'm seeing somebody's trash and somebody's trash is on like the landing of the stairs. And then you go down the stairs. It's a flight of stairs and it's on the outside of somebody's home. That's what I'm seeing. You see them going to these places to really convene about you. And this is definitely people who meet up and you're the topic of discussion. Wow. This is a really deep message. Put a like on a video. If you resonate with this, put a comment if this is what's coming through for you, because this is what's, this is what I'm picking up now, okay? So you have spirit guides that come to you at night. They give you these messages, okay? They give you these messages about what's going on, and you see he has the shield, and you also see the um the antlers or the horns on the animal there. That's very protective energy that's coming in. They're literally telling you like, yo, we're giving you the power to defeat your enemies that's literally what this message is wow i wasn't well the divine chooses what comes out right um somebody's literally your guides are literally giving you the codes on how to defeat your enemy how to not be blocked how to not allow your mind to get you stuck how to identify the energies that are in your body and in your home and the energies that are dwelling in the people that you're meeting. The divine is really, really working with you. Whoa. Like the relationship between you and the divine is amazing. And there is a new moon in Pisces right now. So this is a completely huge time for manifesting greatness. All right. It's big, big. Okay. Especially with the North Node being in Taurus. Y'all know I've been raving about this for years, right? Especially North Node in Taurus. Especially new moon in Pisces, which is influenced and ruled by Jupiter. So you have a lot of good luck, fortune expansion, higher consciousness, um, wisdom, elevating and leveling up within yourself, within your own life. But also your circle is going to reflect that up leveling. So it's a big freaking time right now. It's that fit. And I feel like because it's such a big time, you have more and more and more guidance more influenced by 
your ancestors, not even just from your bloodline, but the ancestors of the land. So some of you have been pouring libations on the land. You've been connecting with the nature spirits as well and giving offerings. Keep freaking doing that. Like some of you, your your guides are congratulating you right now. Wow, this is such a powerful message. This is a powerful, powerful message. Y'all need to like this video and claim this 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 message right now because you're getting a lot of guidance and you're following it. And because you're following it, you're going to be celebrating back to back to back to back. Like I see back to back celebrations for somebody out there. I don't know what it is you got going on, honey. I don't know your new product line is taking off or you go viral or somebody gives you the greatest job opportunity you could have ever dreamed of or you purchase a new home and you didn't even have enough money in the bank to do it. It's just some miracle is happening to you. Somebody buys you a car. Somebody gifts you with um, a new business or land. This is this type of energy. It's magical, really. And it's divinely guided for someone. This is your purpose and your destiny. And also, um, you're, you're taking part in it, I just heard. You're, you're actively taking part in the blessings and miracles. So it's like, this is somebody... You know what your path entails. You know where you're going, but you are also praying and doing your inner work and meditating and tapping into spirit, practicing your psychic gifts. It's like you're proactive with your path and that brings in a lot of good shit. So inner childs came out. You could have definitely been doing inner child work. And then look at this, you know, he does look youthful. So you could have known that you're destined for a certain path from childhood. I just got goosebumps. They told you in childhood, damn, this message is deep. Y'all, I can't even explain to you what this feels like to me right now. They, your guides have been coming to you since childhood. If you resonate with that, leave a message, okay? They've been coming to you, your ancestors, your guides and dreams. You've been seeing them, you've been hearing them and feeling them. And they've been telling you since childhood what your path would entail and that you would be very successful in whatever you're being called in. This is an ordained path. This is an ordained path. They want you to wake up to the path. They want you to fast and pray. Like I was saying, someone is needing to choose the path or you chose the path. Right. They also talk about magic. I keep getting magic, magic, magic. You could have a lot of people, y'all. You could have a lot of people using spell work on you because they want to catch up to you. This is really happening in people's lives. And shout outs to all of you who have been booking sessions with me because that's like the third level of confirmation that this is what's going on. Right. You get that. I get the intel. I see it. And then I have the sessions. And you confirm, yes, this is going on with the chosen. That yes, this is going on with the collective. And then things can be done from that standpoint, right? So this is, yeah, like the page of wands and the seven of wands. It's like the information is coming in to be on guard, right? To tap into your spiritual team, your protection, your practices in order to, you know, stay on track and not self-sabotage because we can get a lot of, we could get really distracted by what's going on around us and in the world that we self-sabotage our true calling and purpose. So it's like the divine comes in and brings you back on track. Okay. Wow. Look, you literally have the other side. You have grandmother. Somebody's grandmother is really, really powerful and really talking to you. Your grandmother Whoever resonates with this message, look, you're powerful, all right? And I feel like that's what you're tapping into this weekend, the power of your thought and your manifestation, the power of your faith, right? You're realizing what comes out of taking leaps of faith and, and trusting and believing in yourself. So it's really freaking powerful. So freaking powerful, all right? So that is the message for your weekend, divine message for the collective, your weekend um, messages, and um, put a like on the video, 
Also, if you need something more specific to your situation, click on the links in the description box to book some time with me. And I will see you on the next one. Peace and love.